Good morning, everybody. My name is Haley, and I decided to randomly do a reading vlog because I haven't done one in a couple weeks. I really enjoy doing them. They're a lot easier for me to film right now because I don't have a ton of time to sit down and film when, like, nobody's home because I don't like filming when people are home. But it's, like, 10 a.m. on Friday, May 25th. I have already started... Battle Royale, which Kate just read and absolutely loved, and I was kind of very surprised by that, so I picked it up immediately after I finished my current read, that which was the other day, and I'm, I don't know, like 40? Yeah, 47 pages in, and it's already very straightforward and to the point, so I figured I would vlog my experience of reading this book and then maybe take it into some other books, depending on how much footage I get and how long this vlog's gonna be. So, just wanted to let you know I'm gonna be vlogging. Maybe I'll get some clips of exciting things this weekend, no promises, because vlogging in public is incredibly awkward, but I'm gonna sit down and read some of this. I'm already on my second cup of coffee and it's only 10 a.m., so here we go. When you literally forget that you were vlogging and it's more than 24 hours later. <laughs> Which, in all fairness, I haven't read more than like 20 or 30 pages, so... Not a ton of reading updates. I'm downstairs doing laundry right now, if you can hear that. And I'm about to start reading more of Battle Royale. And I had church last night and I went to the thrift store and did a ton of stuff today, but I'm finally home and getting stuff done while hopefully reading. So there's an update. It's, <laughs> I have a feeling this vlog is gonna be more spaced out than the rest of mine have been. These seven books are what happens when you go to the thrift store. All the books are 40 cents and you haven't bought very many books in a while. So, yep. <laughs> This happened, and yes, I am laying on my floor to get this shot. Don't mind me. It's literally another whole day and a half later, but I am most exactly halfway through Battle Royale. And I just had one of my characters that I was really enjoying die way too fast, and I'm upset about it. And this is getting more intense by the second, so... I'm really excited to get further in this and maybe finish it today. I doubt it. Maybe. Also, I've started listening to Bird Box on audiobook. So, we'll see how that goes. I'm already kind of weirded out by it. Also, me and Kate were just talking about this. This book is basically... Oh, I really like that person. Oh, oh now they're dead. Oh, I also really like this person. Oh, no, oh, they just got shot. But they're not dead yet. Oh, oh no, now they're dead. Two chapters later. That's, that's the explanation of what this book is. You know, this is such a serious life or death game. And then there's moments of characters complaining about how they don't know how to spell words because they are a casualty of spell check. So writing words is difficult, like, longhand, and it's so funny. <laughs> I was giggling. I'm on page 381, and things just got really intense, and so much is happening. I'm not ready. I might read the rest of this tonight, even though I still have, like, 200 pages, so... It's intense. But I'm pretty far. Also, Kate will get this joke probably more than anyone else because we were just talking about it. But I never want to hear the words vulgar masses in a sentence ever again in my entire life. Because one of the characters said it so many times and I just I hated it so much. <laughs> I got to page 442, I'm in the last section, but I'm so tired, so I'm gonna go to bed and finish the rest of this tomorrow morning, probably, at work, since I am nannying. But 
That is it for me today. Good night. Good morning, everyone. I am planning on finishing this today. I have maybe like less than 200 pages left and I might listen to some of Bird Box later as well when I make food, but that's the plan for today. This is gonna be a crazy ending. I already know it. Guys, there are only four students remaining and it's about to get intense. I have like, 50 pages left and I don't know what's gonna happen and I'm concerned and I'm worried and I'm a little bit convinced that this one guy is invincible so and he's not the one I want to win so that's a problem but hopefully this will be a crazy ending I don't know how it could not be so also I'm gonna attempt to eat my pasta salad while reading this, but I learned that eating while reading this book because it's so gory is not a good idea. So that might not actually happen, but I am hungry. So we'll see if that actually, you know, works out very well. I have 15 pages of Battle Royale left and I'm so upset right now. I don't have any more words. I'm gonna finish it and try not to scream. I just reached the epilogue and I'm upset. Very, very upset. <laughs> that was a crazy ending, though. Augie, are you upset? I'm upset. Come help. Come here. Hi, <gasps> buddy. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you so much. You're so kind. <laughs> Aki, did the book make you sad? How about you, Henry? Are you sad? I'm sad. I... T nobody touched me. I don't have anything to say. I have no words. I finished it. And I'm sad. <laughs> I'm just so sad. Maybe I'll have more coherent thoughts later. When the 18 month old that you babysit loves Disney. <laughs> I don't know. Three. How far can a person hear? Rowing blindfolded is even harder than Mallory had imagined. Many times already, the rowboat has run into the banks and gotten stuck for a period of time.
breakfast is served and I'm gonna continue listening to Bird Box. I'm about an hour or so in, so. As far as an update on Bird Box and how I'm feeling about it goes, like I said, I'm about an hour in and I have issues. <laughs> I don't really like the way that the mom talks about the kids in the present day portion, which it seems to be flipping every other chapter. I do find the past chapter, the chapter set in the past way more interesting, like the actual apocalyptic event of whatever this thing is that's making people go crazy and kill people and kill themselves. But yeah, I don't love Mallory as a character. She's kind of really annoying and I'm just, nah. But I'm gonna keep listening and hopefully I can finish this audiobook in a decent time frame. But for right now, I'm going to eat my breakfast. So I haven't updated it all today, but I literally sat the whole afternoon and watched YouTube videos. So I didn't read anything except for that little bit of bird box this morning. So hopefully more reading will get done tomorrow because I'm going to bed. Good morning, it is Thursday morning, and I'm going to listen to some of the Bird Box audiobook this morning before hopefully filming some videos if the lighting will cooperate. Okay, I'm going to apologize in advance. I have a mint in my mouth, and it's very early. But I've been listening to more of the Bird Box audiobook, and... There were just some really casual, not explained, or even really talked about child abuse. And Kate did say that she like felt like it wasn't explained even in the rest of the book when she read it. And I'm like, why are people loving this book if that's never questioned or even brought to light as, you know, wrong or messed up, no matter what situation you're in. I'm not a happy camper, and if this narrator wasn't such a good narrator, I would have probably DNF'd this book a long time ago, because while it is interesting, I really don't like our main character, Mallory, like, at all. So, yeah. Those are my thoughts on Bird Box right now. I'm about 28% into it, and I'm just very not happy. <laughs> but we'll see how the rest of this goes, and we'll see if I can actually finish it. Hello, it's later. I filmed a bunch of videos, which hopefully will turn out well so I can post them over the next couple of weeks. But I'm listening to Bird Box again, and I just have to say, who calls their children boy and girl? Like, that's how she refers to them. Sorry, that was the microwave I'm making lunch. But who just calls their children, like, calls it boy is how she, like, calls out to the little boy or, like, calls the little girl girl. I'm like, that's, that's not how children work. You have to call them by their name. I, hmm. Sarah, I'm really annoyed by this main character, and it's stressing me out every time I listen to it. I don't know if I can do this. So I got really mad at the Bird Box audiobook because the main character was annoying me. So I'm taking a break from it and watching people's YouTube videos instead. <laughs> I'm currently watching Vanessa's long weekend reading vlog because I'm behind and I have a bunch of videos to catch up on so that's the situation right now no reading is getting accomplished so it's like 5 p.m. and I've just accepted that I'm not gonna get any more reading done today so I'm just gonna wrap up this reading vlog sorry for the cliffhanger on Bird Box I really don't know if I'm gonna finish it or if I'm gonna end up DNFing it but I will keep you updated either in another video or on Goodreads. So thank you all for watching and I will see all of you guys next time.